Africa, with a population of 1.3 billion, or 16.6% of world population, accounts for less than 4% of the global world aviation traffic. How do you relate to that perennial difficulty complaint that aviation and tourism are unable to talk to each other, unable to progress together? Touristic routes are not profitable or it takes really long and long, long time to make it profitable. And what we did in Morocco was um, to go into the open sky, into an open sky agreement. And I always say that um, at that time, the Minister of Transport, that was only Minister of Transport, was the real Minister of Tourism because he was the one opening the skies of Morocco. We keep hearing this in Kenya, uh, open more routes so there'll be more tourists. Uh, namely, the job of the airline is to bring the tourists because they create the connectivity. I, I have a pretty straightforward answer. For me, it's the chicken first. So what's the chicken? Uh, I don't know from my online travel experience any tourist who starts selecting a place of his uh, uh, leisure by taking the flight. They, they all first go to check the hotel. So the first that you need to create in order to have a demand for tourists is uh, tourist infrastructure. If we have to generalize or bring uh, some common formulas appealing to uh, countries in a similar type of situation, I think it depends on the level of tourism uh, sector development in the country. Airlines are always in front of the base rela in relating to the, to the authorities. But they, they can go together to make more events together, workshops, conferences as well, and to address the safety issues together. When we were in the world, in the course of these years, au niveau de l'Afrique, the tendance a beaucoup donc évolué. Hein, donc, euh, il y a maintenant de moins en moins des accidents. L'État doit mettre les moyens nécessaires pour que l'aviation fonctionne selon ses règles. Je pense que ce n'est pas des choses qu'il faudrait négocier. Et nous, en tant que patrons des compagnies aériennes, nous devons être les premiers whistleblowers au cas où il y a quelque chose qui n'est pas conforme, qu'on essaye de ramener nos collaborateurs à cette réalité. Security is very important. Uh, as a cargo airline, we have had a tendency of flying to some very unsafe regions, like for example Yemen, uh, where we operate a very humanitarian, a very large humanitarian mission. But I think the most important thing is the fact that our civil aviation authority has uh, complied with ICAO SARPs, and in addition to that, they have actually instilled a very strong sense of uh, safety and security within within the operators.